tuning. And of course, her teammate, Tony Kanan, team leader when it comes to setting up these cars. And they obviously have a good setup this evening. This coming Wednesday night at Eldora Speedway, owned of course by Tony Stewart. We'll get to that later as we have Simona Di Silvestro against the Safer Barrier. A lot of flash and flame coming out of there. And those flames are usually caused by oil. But and look at how much is up on the right yeah, front. Oh, yeah, there. this is. Uh, That's not good. A little more serious than an oil fire, I'm afraid. Let's get, uh, get the fire. Wow. Jeez, we got to get her out of there, but quick. Come on, come on. a little bit of difficulty doing so. Go get let's, her out, let's get her get, out. Let's get the flames uh, retarded here, shall we? Man. There's an extinguisher bottle. Come on, get it on there. Having just all kinds of difficulty getting her out of the race car. You need to get the head restraint out, and they were trying to do so, but it was binding, and it... It is very difficult to get out of these cars. Obviously, the team is livid. Yeah. Mm. But but there she is. She's out. So that's great. Yeah. Of course, the uh, the driver's suits protect in flames to a certain degree. But that was a major, major fire. I haven't seen a fire in an Indy car like that in quite a while. I was expecting, and I, I said sort of nonchalantly, well, yeah. that's usually from a gearbox or from and an oil yeah. cooler. It catches fire, mm -hmm. and then by the time it comes to stop, it just goes yeah. out by itself. You got the, the hot headers. It explodes. Right. The oil gets on there, and it's kind of a, a flash fire. Well, what it did was it caught the bodywork on fire, and mm. then, of course, it grew instead of just dissipating. See, the head restraint is still intact. And there's two clips that you have to undo and lift that out. And your head is almost a force fit in there because you saw Jack with the bowling balls talking about that kind of G-force. You actually, it's a press fit for the helmet. Well, you've got to get that head restraint out of there to make easy exit. Eventually, they just forget it, try to turn her sideways, and you could see, yank her out of the yeah. car. Yeah, which is painful. Yes. I mean, the, that's, a, that's a small gap to do it, but... You know, they had to get her out of there. And like you say, to get those clips off of there, that wasn't the thought process. It was just to get her out.